Welcome back. NWC co-champ Columbus Grove looking for their deepest playoff run since their trip to the state semis in 2014. Tonight, they take on Seneca East, who has won six games in a row. But the Bulldogs would represent the second best team the Tigers have played this year. They lost to the best team on their schedule, Mohawk, in September. Crowd getting ready for this one from Frost Kalnow Stadium. Number one seed Seneca East and Columbus Grove will get started. Garrett Niemeyer with the big run down to the 30 yard line. And how about some big passing action? Blake Reynolds hits Caleb Barrientes. Nice sliding catch to set him up first and goal. And Niemeyer would go ahead and cap off the drive with a touchdown. That put Grove up early. Seneca East, Mason Foose hits Blaine Schwartzmiller after some scrambling and hits the corner front corner of the end zone for the touchdown. Do you like scrambling? I know you do. How about Reynolds having to scramble? Going backwards, doing his Mitchell Trubisky impression there for a second. Now he takes off and he's going to pick up a couple yards with that. Dry wouldn't go anywhere. Seneca East gets it back. Fumble, but they're able to jump back on top of this. And they would respond. Foos, screen pass. DJ roughing. No roughing the passer. Just taking it to the house. 55 yards for the score. This one went up going into double overtime. And Seneca East comes away with a 27 20 victory in double overtime. And you can catch this one tomorrow at noon and 7 p.m. on WOSN.